one shot. There hasn't been a bucket in this game in an hour. That's forever. Double D. One bucket, Hank. One fucking bucket, bro. This guy's gonna whap it right in our face. Oh. Ten. Tight. Push Five. it. Push it. Just go to the rack. Tight. Go to the rack. Go. Don't go settle for a jump shot. Go Tight. to the rack. Get the go to the rack. What are they doing? Go what are they doing? Yeah. Let's go. Fuck yeah. The Come on. What? Is it a Come on. You said you were gonna ride with me, and you did it. I am March. What the fuck? I am March. You you haven't taken any of my. Fight. I am March. Come on. As you can tell, I haven't been here very long. But I stuck the scissors in there. I didn't actually like physically touch the AC. I touched the scissors, which were inside the AC. But you didn't put the scissors in the AC. No, I did. I, I've admitted to that. Okay, I downloaded the pirate porn. He did it. It's actually he did fucking it. did it. Simon <laughs> fucking did it. First drill, right here. I'm the boss and the most athletic. Booyah! You all saw it. Roll that dice. Boom. Face it. There's the hops. There's no hops. How do you walk out, take a mirror that's this big out of a dumpster because they won't take it, turn around, walk in, pick up a copier, and throw the copier in the dumpster? That's going to be the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. And the home of the Boston company. Even still now, I say like half the people who work for us have Boston roots. I grew up on the North Shore. All my friends are like Boston suburbs. We had our office in Milton. That was our first office, that little dentist office. We were there for, I don't know, 10 years. But the plan was always to go back to Boston as fast as we can. That's what the common guy likes. Stop and look at the door when you pass it. What? Just stop and, and look at it. At the door. <laughs> what? Another place, that's my first place, right there. 25. Oh, 259 actually, right there, that crazy ass window. With Elio? No, I live by myself there. Month to month, fucking all sorts of issues. Is it true that Barcel started in, in Abington or Swampscott? So Swampscott. Weren't you, wasn't Abington in the mix for a little bit? Yep, but I mean, I met, I met Renee while I was handing out newspapers. Okay. Renee, yeah. we live in her, in an in-law apartment in Abington, but she's from Abington, so I mean, I met her after I started Barstool. It was Swamp Scott actually to here. I lived here, and then to Abington. Do you know how bad of a place that has to be? Do you know how much that rent was? It was like 700 bucks. bucks a month to live right there. The place was like a little nothing. You couldn't control the heat. The whole building was heat controlled. It's 9,000 degrees in there. Such a good review, Hank. We had yes, I had a beef shop. All these little kids came up. You, it's gonna disgust you, man. He's like talking to me. He's like, I can't take a picture. Kid pulls out his phone. Fucking Patrick Mahomes screensaver. I go, what are you doing? And he's like, what do you mean? I'm like, why the fuck do you have a Mahomes? The kid had to be eight. I'm like, why the fuck do you have a Mahomes? No, how old is he? 11? And I'm like, why do you have a Mahomes screensaver? He's like, what do you mean? I like him. I'm like, you like him? I mean, what about the pages? Like we stink. You, I, I couldn't. I was mortified. I was like, "How spoiled are you?" That's the state. I was. I almost did, was like, "I can't go back to anywhere. I gotta re reset the state." Oh, these are kind of awesome. What's going on? Oh, this is fucking sick. It's a diet, kid. <laughs> I've been intermittent fasting. The pounds drop like fucking. 
like that. It's crazy. I fully embrace 2X though. I like baggy, you know? A little yogurt parfait. Yeah, I'm still at a career high right now. 276. I can't figure it out. I mean, you're, old, you're getting older. I know, and but I'm like, eat like shit. I'm and you trying. drink beer. Hey, classic Elio fashion. He goes, I'm guaranteeing I'm going to go six and one this weekend. I was like, even in like your perfect world, you, you put in a loss. <laughs> He's like six and one. That's my record. Ice and data. Stephen Che being on vacation has been the worst. Elio. You got a lot of food. Stay <laughs> I brought it from my restaurant. I brought 10 pizzas, chicken parm sub, buffalo tenders, mozzarella sticks, all the stuff that we love to eat, you know, chow down. We're all big guys. I need to get carried today by somebody. I'll get you. Nobody can get me because I don't listen. That's yeah, that is the problem. I literally gave you a plus 150 parlay last night and you just, you just didn't do it. I need, I, I need plus 500 or more. You can go perfect today. Why you, not? You, you Why can. not? Why not? Welcome, welcome. Well, 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 it up, it up, Good day, good day. We are live in Massachusetts. We've got a big crew here. We're gonna be here all day. Uh, so let's go. Yeah, he's the reason we I took Purdue. Whit yeah. Ryan Whitney is the reason. Set me out. Come on, man. Off now. I'm, 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 I gave it. No, so. you did not. <laughs> We're just taking over this little area. Positive vibes ice cream. Yeah, I mean I need one right away. That early? Uh huh. It's early. Not even half time at the ice cream room. What was that pass, man? Oh, what a rebound! Oh, no. Is that Yao Ming? It looks like Yao. <laughs> Come on, Yao. Oh, we don't stop Yao! Yes. They yes. don't stop him! Kids are under 18. 18. These are grown ass no, adults. Right. They could move out of their thank house. You. Thank you. They could move yeah. out of their house and do whatever they want. I'm watching everything. No, you're not. Yes, I am. You just asked. I mean, you didn't know. even know free throws existed until I told you that 10 minutes ago. Stop! Stop! <laughs> Ah! What a fucking joke. <laughs> ah! Lime, <laughs> Lime, high noon tequila. I'm a big tequila guy. Wow, it's dangerous. The people gotta know what's in the brief. You know, today it's just really, what do we got in here? I think it's just the computer, we got some odds and ends, nothing nothing crazy. Oh, I got some ice shirts, I got my sunglasses, little Breeders Cup info, Zen 6s, some chargers, pants. Dave usually needs all this stuff, I usually carry extra stuff for Dave. Chapstick, all that good stuff. Just put 145, 57 seconds. Yep. Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Yes! 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 yes. Last shot, last shot. Have to take last shot. Oh my god. Oh my god. What a horrible yes. play. Yes! That was the worst yes. play. Yes! That was the worst play. What a fucking play. That was the worst. Push it. Go, Go, to Go, Go to the rack. Go to the rack. Don't settle for a jump shot. Go to the rack. I'm not rich. And then we fucking ended it. I'm not rich. No, then you took a different part away. <laughs> right. Then you took a different part away. You're right, you're right. You asked for a 
parlay. What was you that? You asked for a parlay. I sent you one, right. then you took a different one. That was it. That was it. <laughs> Who texts someone saying, "Can you give me a play? You know I how want I a parlay." You know I sent him a parlay. Did it win? Yeah, my parlay won. And he, yeah. and then he goes, "Oh well, I he took one. I took one piece of your parlay. I didn't take the other." And then he's complaining, crying in the car. He got no coins. My Good head, win. my head isn't there. Though. Good win. Good win. You, I was thinking about you all day. No, no. Good win. I was upset that you all game. I don't know why. I'm out. I'm going. I'm leaving. No, 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 we're gonna fight. Gonna we're gonna even. keep fighting no, now. No, we're gonna leaving. ride. No. This is what we're gonna do. No. We're, gonna, we're gonna ride something. No, stop. What do you wanna ride? I'll ride. No, you won't. I wanna ride. I wanna ride. You won't ride. No, I gave you a chance really last night and you spit in my face. No. Oh, don't worry, Dutch. You can't get away right now. Tough. I don't know if I'll bounce back. I haven't lost them. Listen, if I had won some bets in that time frame, I'd feel a lot different, but I lost. I lost it all. You think, listen. I rode the CLP today. He gave me a parlay the, yesterday, and I didn't take it. I took a piece out of it. The parlay ended up hitting, so he won money on it. I did. For the Marquette game, he knew my bet. It was my lock of the day, Marquette. He said he was going to ride. He didn't ride. My brain's not like everybody's brain. My brain has some type of switch. When I'm winning gambling and I'm winning big, I snap. I turn into a different person. I can't control it. And I, and I took it out on him. And for that, I apologize. I tried to give him a winner right now. I gave it to him. He said he's not ready yet. And that's just where we're at. Interesting. What's interesting? interesting. I rode the CLP earlier. Uh, we'll just see how these games go, and I'll let you know if we can get back together. <laughs> Why do I keep putting myself in relationships that hurt me? Abusive one-way streets? Three plus two is five. Two plus three is five. Five! We need a goal by the little worst team in the league. Get in. Yes! 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 Three plus three is seven. Look at this right here. Look at this. Oh my God! Holy shit! Stephen right, right now. Hey, down look, one listen. Says. He's gonna hit it. He, his his no, numbers no, don't lie. I, I have all the faith in the world in my part. Hundred percent. I love him. I love this guy. I love this guy. <laughs> 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 we can lose this bet. All right, all right, take your time. Slow, slow, slow. We're gonna go on half down town. Score and we get it. Score and we get it, Jer. That this is this 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 is. Oh my God! This is <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Don't move your neck. 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 Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. I'll tell you what happens. I'll tell you what happens. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Don't move your neck. Stay down. Stay down. I'll tell you what happens. I'll tell you what happens. Don't look. Don't look. I'll tell you what happens. I'll tell you what happens. I'll tell you what happens. All right. Arizona State. They're driving. Just steal. Jerry Madness continues. Jerry Madness continues. The thing that pissed me off about that was like, people were like, oh, that was fake. Okay, I'm fucking 8 and 0 at that time, or 8 and 1 at that time. It's at literally 12 at night. Nobody else is on stream. People are probably barely watching the fucking stream. The ball, literally, you see it gets stuck in between my legs. And when I fell, the ball rolled up my legs to my back. You hear, you hear the crack. You hear it, right? You hear the crack in the video. I mean, why would I risk getting a concussion at the most important time of the year? Right when you're getting hot. Yeah, yeah. right when I'm getting hot. March is underway. Basketball is in full swing. Where are you guys sitting right now? <laughs> we're in the midst of the chaos. We're about to do a live show, but we're also watching Penn State uh, try to complete a comeback. This is what this month is all about. This is the best three-week stretch of the entire year if you're a college basketball fan. So let the games begin. You give me a blank bracket, 
at 6 p.m. Monday, I will be able to fill it out. This is a legacy play for me. I've had a, I've had a rough stretch. My last two national champion picks have uh, lost in the first round, and the people t- are talking. The haters are talking. I hear them. The pressure's on. We're going to see if I can deliver. Holy shit. Badgers are going to go dancing. All right, welcome to the Barstool Bracket Show. The wait is just about over. The field of 68 just minutes away from being revealed. Jeff Kilo, shut it up! <laughs> SVP hit me up earlier today. Yep. He's like, make sure. You know what? He's spinning. Year. He's spinning. You know what? Here we go. Oh, absolutely. He's sitting at his desk. First thing he said to me is, let me see your tits. <laughs> there you go. I thought he was just saying hi. You wrote down like every team. I wrote down. Nineteen. Yeah, nineteen. <laughs> I'm gonna go with. Uh, I think it's always good to pick a like a normal school. I'm gonna go with USC. Yeah, normal school. school. <laughs> Who are you picking? Um, Kansas. Why is Frank freaking out? Take Kansas. Big T, we going Utah State. That's correct, Billy. You knew. You knew. Let's go, baby. Great take, Marty. Who are you picking? Probably fucking the 16 playing game. <laughs> they said that whoever gets the worst pick has to play for the fight to Ireland. Buster wouldn't do that to you. Are they not here? Kind of a big deal, huh? Can't be bothered to show up for a Zoom call. Chicklets boys should get Colgate. Colgate, there we go, 15 seconds. Chicklets might not have checked their email. I don't know if they personally called Biz. And they're still gonna get a better pick talk than Frank, so. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they got the 15, they got a 15 seed. Confirmed. I'm sh- <laughs> shocked that Biz did not check his email response. <laughs> Arizona State. Okay. Arizona State. Let's we'll take a drink. Arizona State. It's a fucking State. loser if I've ever heard one. They're not even going to win the playing game. They always make a run. That's not the one, though. Well, the other one's not on the board. All right, next up. This is not going to be Frank or Doug's because I'm making sure Frank picks last. Jeff Kilo, shut it up! <laughs> well, we're thinking that if we get to Ireland, we'll bring some cameras, but nobody's ever going to see that content, yeah, for sure. It would confuse their audience. <laughs> and we're concerned about their fragile minds. KB, you want a shot? No, thanks. It's a sponsor, KB. You're supposed uh, yeah. to say, absolutely, I would love a shot. <laughs> Mark Titus and Jake Marsh, once again, not Doug's and not Frank, just for the record. Frank's going to win. He's going to win a, a trip to Siberia. Two college basketball guys, so you guys allegedly know what you're doing. If someone else wins, they are invited to my wedding. Next up, we have Wallow and Gilly. Give him t- uh, 16 against Alabama. That was the first choice. Who's the most fair person in this room? Frank. Frank. <laughs> Frank. Okay. All right, Frank, Frank's going to decide. Frank, who are Wallow and Gilly taking? They're going to take the 16 seed against Alabama, Texas A&M, CC, and uh, S- 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 Southern Missouri. Miss- Miss- Pat, Joey, and Hannah Cook. I literally, I'm going to be the last one picked. I literally <laughs> know I'm going to be the last one picked. I, 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 Cornelli just joined. It's uh, 35 minutes past the draft. Help me out here. It's very appropriate that someone named Chicklets gets Colgate. <laughs> yeah. The dental school. Well, I gave him to him, Frank. <laughs> Frank had it first. Next up, we have Smitty and Tico, Texas. We are definitely going to Smitty and Tico, Texas. Texas. Who do we got left? Grand, Grand, Grand. Grand. Okay, we can take the Grand Grand Grand. Let's go. You get the entire Grand Grand. Let's go. Uh, sorry, Blatler. Sorry, Princeton. Wait, wait. Joke's on her. Next up, we have Dave, Clem, and Eddie. Dave, Clem, and Eddie. I'd just like to say Grand Candy was my first pick of the whole thing, and KFC and Fiberg shouldn't get them for the fact they clearly weren't paying any attention at all to this. Uh, let's, why don't I just take Asheville? Yeah, Asheville. Asheville, 50. All right, next up we have Brianna and Grace. <laughs> Brianna and Grace. Are her and then there were two. I'm going to go with this one. <clears throat> Frank does oh, 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 it. Nordic Kentucky. We got a pick. <laughs> what are you taking? Nordic Kentucky. I mean, Whoa, what's the other option? Fairly ridiculous. <laughs> Fairly ridiculous shouldn't even be in the damn tournament. As first reported by Buster Olney, uh, you guys <laughs> picked second to last in the Barstool Bracket Buster. Good luck, guys. Great job, KFT. Congratulations on on this. Great job, KFT. Picking glass next to last is the same as picking glass. I mean, no, you have I'm no actually, choice. It's a little better. Frank, you know I did that on purpose, right? Yes, I do. <laughs> How would I have done that on purpose? Yes, <laughs> you had a little market problem. Yeah, yeah, it is. I had 10 schools in my head. And I just watched them all go bing, 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 bing. What Frank doesn't realize is like, this is 
everyone that he's in the Truman Show, and so everybody that he interacts with on a daily basis, like we've got our script that we have to follow. I don't like doing it, but I mean that's what they tell me to do, and so I don't want to get fired. I like my job. You know something? Yeah. That if me and the Mean Girl Correct. team end up going to Ireland together, yeah. I actually think it'd be kind of fun. Go find some dinosaur fossils, busker tasting, and get into some screaming matches. Ascension, Massachusetts, the founding home of Barstool Sports, is now the latest state to offer the Barstool Sportsbook. So if you're in Massachusetts, download the Barstool Sportsbook app and sign up today to take advantage of our Cue the Duck Boats offer. Any cash wager of $5 or more will earn new users a $50 bonus bet on the Celtics to win the NBA championship and a $50 bonus bet on the Bruins to win the Stanley Cup. The Barstool Sportsbook is the official sportsbook of Barstool Sports and the only place to find exclusive bets and odds boosts from your favorite Barstool personalities. Dave Portnoy, Big Cat, Brandon Walker, Rico Bosco, Jersey Jerry, Frank the Tank, Lenny Ball, Pico Texas, and there's great features that you want within your sportsbook. Live in-game betting, parlay plus to bet within the same game or across sports, move the line and teaser bets, easy and secure for registration, deposit, and withdrawal. Must be 21 plus. If you or a loved one is experiencing gambling problems, call 800-327-5055 for 24-7 support. Play it smart from the start with GameSense. Visit GameSenseMA.com. Does it have memory? I feel like I'm recording The Office. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I did ask Hunter, I was like, where should we go tonight? I forgot we we're talking to like a college kid. So I think this is like an outback. I thought we were going to go to a steakhouse, you know? Yeah, I was, I was scared I didn't have clothes to like dress nice. Yeah, no, I think I, I'm pretty sure like the steak's like 28 bucks, which I... Perfect. That's great. I'm going to Hunter, uh, meet up with Hunter, game night, game day before night. Yeah. Game... It's game time, baby. It's game time. I think the vibes are going to be outstanding. I think the steak's, the steak's going to be mediocre. I think so, too. Look how much of a big fuck he is. <laughs> <laughs> Dresses like a bum, too, the night before the game. <laughs> how we doing, baby? What up? How are you, Hunter? He's taller than I expected. First time has met the Hunter in person. Oh, that is true. Yeah, I forgot about that. And I'm pretty good. I just got out of the cold tub. It was good practice, so hopefully, you know, we're prepared for this one. Alright, that's media guy. That's a media answer right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, straight media, straight media. After, after ski mask game, straight media. Alright, let's go eat some steak. Mine can put the camera down. Oh, we got the kielbasa. Let's <laughs> try to do it like this one here. Just throw it out there. Yeah. Look how, like, it's like, it's like 600 degrees. This is what we do the night before a big game. Yeah. We, we, Damn, you're tall as hell. I'm like, I'm 6'3", and I look at the phone. 6'2"? 6'3". <laughs> Thank See, you. It is funny you have to duck that. It's just a normal doorway. <laughs> <laughs> For everyone that says that I suck off Hunter, I just met the parents. Things are going well. Alright, we are Saturday of game day. It's game day. Couldn't sleep last night. I'm tossing and turning. So excited for the game. We're going to breakfast with the big bastard. And we're going to follow him around today, see what kind of uh, day he has planned for his rivalry. I got to be honest, I don't think he knows what he's doing. I'm trying to do B roll. We'll turn it down. You're the only one that's clear. Oh, I'll ask him. Yeah, how are you feeling after that meal? Very full, satisfied. We're the champions. How was it, Marty? It was fantastic. If I got the ball, I have one move that with his knees would bump. Marty's told me the move like five times. <laughs> I'd be so prepared for it to be insane. You think Jordan could score on you? Michael? <laughs> Dude, he was saying, he was just saying in the car how much better Rutgers treats him. <laughs> so funny, when I walked like too close, like, I, can't, I just can't get Hunter in the camera. He's lining up like Mello in that meme where Mello like fakes the dribble. Did you play high school ball? That, rare, that looks high. Can you dunk? No, can you dunk? <laughs> Dude, 
your three pointer now. Marty, you've already used up the move. <laughs> oh my god. You had him, Dukes. Dukes, you had him. You just tried to do the same exact move <laughs> that Dukes did. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I have no idea where we parked. It was kind of weak at first, but then when it got going, it was fucking really loud. So it was a great experience. That was an insane game. Obviously, yeah. the game was a little unfortunate, um, you know, heading in. Uh, we just tried to go out there and honor the players. I mean, honor the guys, um, the victims uh, from the unfortunate shooting. The crowd was crazy, and fortunately for us, we came out there with a win, so we'll go out there and turn up. People do say I jerk you off. You did, dude. This celebration was this. It's the BDE. So, you are 1-0 in Michigan, for sure. You gotta come back for more. I'm 1-0 in one. Go Michigan. blue, baby, yes, sir. It's over! It's fucking over! We have no fucking closure now! It is fucking out! He tore his goddamn ACL! This is fucking ridiculous! God damn it, God damn it! I motherfucking hate this motherfucking World Baseball fucking classic. I rest my fucking case. This team is fucking cursed. Happy Thursday. There's nothing happy about today. It's pain, misery, and suffering. 24-7, 365. Yeah, fucking sucks. That fucking smile on goddamn fucking Scott Van Pelt's face. Chipper Jones laughing about it. I want to punch Chipper Jones in the fucking face. Yeah. I motherfucking hate him! All you have there? to do is just wait and Frank will be right. In fairness to Frank here, the World Baseball Cup, he said from the outset, <laughs> he said, Some, I don't want the mess to be involved in the World Baseball Classic because someone's going to get hurt. And sure enough, we missed the end. So he did say that before the World Baseball Classic started. I think closer is the most replaceable position in baseball. I agree with that. You know who's, you know who's the closer going to be? Jose Bato. Bato! Butto, Butto's gonna, gonna Butto's gonna, gonna, careful the specs. Go 85, have 85 blow chase and an ERA of infinity! Was it like uh, you saw his knee pop? Like no, no, they were all like doing this thing, and then all of a sudden <laughs> he's on the ground. You know, <laughs> no. he's like at the bottom of the dog pile. Like, no. Like, no. Exactly. Uh, you know, everyone tried to pick up a leg, and he started screaming. They had to carry him out on his shoulders because he couldn't even do. That. I don't. I, yeah. That's what makes me think maybe hopefully it's a patella thing and then they'll fix it soon. I just I just look I look at I look at how the, the leg look. It, it's a torn ACL. Oh, it's no, bad. I don't know about I'm that. Well, better than MCL ACL. He'll be out for the year. Disagree. Oh, for a pitcher? Which we all have to ask which knee it is. If it's if it's this one, so that's going to be I would think more damage than this. But I'm sure if you're that fucked up, it's fine. He's in a wheelchair. Mm. The Mets no. are done. Yeah, be like, done. They are going to lose 100 games at least. At least. Yeah. <laughs>
In fairness, I didn't know this was a trumpet guy, and then he got hurt celebrating, so I think Frank is justified in his anger today. No, he should be. Yeah, I'd be pissed. No, I, I was like angry. Like, like, I'm still upset. The best thing that happened to Frank is a is an Edwin Diaz injury, so we can talk about how he's right all the time. Uh, yeah, I can't. Fucking loser. The problem is that he does it all season long when the Mets are winning, you know, 100 fucking games, so nobody cares anymore because he cries wolf all the time. But yeah, it sucks when you're a Mets fan because bad things happen to you like this. Guess what? Last year wasn't like this. This sucks. Last year was awesome. <laughs> We're doing a uh, KFC commercial, Double Down. It's not not KFC Barstool. The slates say KFC Barstool, but we're not talking about KFC Barstool. We're talking about Kentucky Fried Chicken doubling down on Pup Punk. So they asked us, they were like, hey, can you guys write something that's like one minute long and then use that one minute to get your point across the camera? So we wrote a one minute song. <laughs> yeah. We're kind of the one minute men. Big fan of the Double Down sandwiches. Two breasts. Nice. If you're gonna hit someone, uh -huh. that's the softest part. That's like a sixteenth of an inch balsa wood, uh -huh. a little frame behind it. This, no good. The handle will fall right off, and the strings will fall right off. So don't hit anyone with that part. Don't hit them with the hard part. Okay, hit them with the soft part. Yes. I mean, you can hit them here also if you want, but that'll probably hurt more because there's metal parts there. Yeah. It's a twelve hundred dollar guitar designed specifically to be smashed. Uh, that seems like the biggest. Why would you buy a racket of all time? Guitars, man. That's what we're saying. Give us the extra off the top, you know? You should take this guitar to a pawn shop, <laughs> yeah. sell it, and then buy a $50 one. Guitar, yeah. And then now we're talking. That's $1,200. <laughs> What are we talking about? Are. What a lucrative are you, business. Are you telling me this? It's made out of paper mache. <laughs> yeah, the neck is the neck. It's solid. It's <laughs> yeah, not going to yeah. break. Just be careful because the only part that breaks is all of this. <laughs> okay, got it. Yeah. <laughs> no offense, you kind of want to hit you over the head with this thing. I, I would take it. It's guitar time. <laughs> this is going to be a completely unusable clip. I don't think that Brandon cheated at all. In fact, I know that he didn't, but I do think it's very funny to accuse Brandon of cheating because he's going to flip out about it. He's going to be like, I would never do such a thing. I just don't see why this is a big deal. Why do you have to, why do you have to watch the show? Right. Why, why, can't, why can't you just wait till it's on YouTube? Like, What's the know. difference in watching the show live and watching it recorded? There is none. Exactly. That's the point. You keep saying, saying that. So why would I watch something Thursday? No, it's, it's edited, yeah. so you don't have to like. Why would I watch through all the bullshit? Why watch something Thursday if I can watch it Monday? If he wasn't from the South, imagine the unspeakable things he'd say about Southerners. You redneck, <laughs> hillbilly, <laughs> dumb fuck. He does talk like he's inside of like a 1990s. WrestleMania episode. He's always cutting a promo for himself. The uh, smartest motherfucker that's ever walked the face of this <laughs> earth. I got sperm that works good and I got a good set of hair. Good. My wife's got huge tits. Right? <laughs> <laughs> works more that's, American than that. That's me, Brandon Walker. The smartest right. son of a bitch in this office. I'm the best looking. I'm the tallest. Do the most push ups. My wife's got tits like Bazooka Joe's. <laughs> I feel my bicep. <laughs> Big swimmers, got damn it. I got Michael Phelps, Katie Ledecky. And the girl from Penn. We're serving up double downs. We're shredding. We're rocking. We're getting gnar. Uh, first time you should do the playback of the song. Then we'll do some like stylized profile stuff. And then pretend you're riding a chicken sandwich. Okay, here we go. I have no idea what I'm doing. I've been tripping all day. Meat tripping. So we get one take of this. Chris, are you actually taking it? I would take the hat off because of the button on the I mean, I'm going to back it might be funny in like the news. So let's try to turn me into Alec Baldwin. He's like, no, take the hat off. How hard am I supposed to hit him? It's balsa wood. I mean, give him a bang. I got it. Cool. This is guitar hit. Only take we got.
I'll double down with you. And everybody look to Nick's camera and just be sexy. I'm gonna have to do that. <laughs> yeah, like that. Everybody I didn't know it was gonna be spicy. That hot I got chip, I'm still recovering from that fucking thing. That shit is so painful. Mm. Oh, the chip? That was the, the worst. The chip was the worst thing I've ever had in my entire life. Bro, I Talked agree. Up for days. I ran Dude, from the old office to the 7 Eleven, drank milk in the 7 Eleven. I honestly think that it fucked up my like esophagus for the rest of my life. Like it burned holes in me. And what it did to my asshole, I can't even talk about on camera. I put a half moon ice cube up my asshole. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I shoved it right up there. I let it sit there for at least a minute. You got my mouth full of food over here. Oh, I had what to, the bro. hell? I had to, dude. Did it work? Yes. Wait, a half moon? You know the half moon slices? The crescent ones, yeah. That's why they smoothed the edges out. <laughs> so you, you shoved one up your asshole, like halfway up there. What if it got Wait, stuck up there? Halfway? Bro, I needed it on the rim. And I was screaming. I was living at my parents at the time. I was like, Mom! Get me an ice cube! What was she saying? She just reached in like this. Bro, like, shit got crazy. It was life or death. It, I it, need an ice cube to stick up my ears. <laughs> Listen, I'm not proud of it, but I also, uh, it was it was like live or die. She checked in on you later and she was like, How's, how's the butthole? I, sh I didn't give her many reasons as to why. Yeah. Galileo. 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 As long as you're not moving. I love it. Uh, yeah. I think that's a wrap. Thank you. Thank you guys. Good job. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you everybody. This is gonna be the one that's gonna take you to the top. We were really, really good and we knew it. Why not? Too bad! Out of my house. Alright, get it together! You're a nerd! Each other! I don't need any of you! Hey guys, I'm back. It's Owen Roeder from earlier. And I work here again. I'm gonna be working on the Son of a Boy Dad podcast as well as the Out of Order sketch comedy show. I slept for an hour last night. <laughs> So want to go into detail about this video, or? I, I, I don't no, know. I can't go into detail. I haven't watched it. I'll never watch it. Out of order. We've been working on for many, many months, and it's very excited that it's out, and it's gonna continue to come out every month. I was in it. I the people too. in the room laughed when we filmed it. I trust the producers made a good show out of it. Um, I have no idea. And I'll never have any idea. I don't <laughs> like me. <laughs> yeah, we got Lil Sasquatch and John Feidelberg teaming up to. Uh, Play, play some characters and sketches, and uh, we got a team of uh, producers and editors that are bringing some great production quality to it. I edited it. Okay, yeah. gotcha. He's a star. I don't know what he's nervous <laughs> for. He won't watch it. He said one time he shot me a text like 3 a.m. saying like, can I, can I just see it? We were in Amsterdam. He was in Amsterdam. Fucked, Fucked up in Amsterdam. Amsterdam. <laughs> I'm mushrooms and shit face. I don't remember. If I, if I watched it then, I don't remember. I've been trying to get John to do some more acting ever since uh, um, making a gambler in it, so I'm very happy he's back in it. No, it's... <laughs> I think it's going to get good reception. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't even like talking about it. This fucking sucks. I can't even look at the camera or anyone in this room. <laughs> You're like, why Why try new things? Why do? Just be complacent. People are like, you yeah. got to get out of your comfort zone. Why? It's super comfortable here. Like, the water is warm as hell in my comfort zone. Repeat those intentions for me once more. To fuck. We could be raising a future Beyonce. This could be a new Beyonce. Do you want a beer, dude? Give me a fucking beer. Let's go. Light crowd tonight. Happy to be here. New York. This is fun. My sister was born blonde and now she's a bitch. She's a slide. You guys made a mountain out of a molehill with this one. We're gonna shoot him in the head. We're gonna shoot your dad in the fucking head. Yeah. Oh, and just for legal reasons, uh,